Hi everyone, meteorologist Anthony Baglione here on this Friday where we are seeing some chilly temperatures across the area. We made it to 34 degrees at RDU, so just above freezing, but it was the coldest morning so far this entire season that we have been in, which is technically still fall. Our previous coldest day was on November 17th, so not that far ago, not that long ago, at 38. Heading through today, so here's a look at what we're expecting. We're still going to be on the cool side, right around 51. That is chillier than where we were yesterday. We hit the upper 50s yesterday. All in all, those should come with partly cloudy skies. It'll be quiet as far as no rain or certainly no snow or anything here. It will still be a bit blustery, though. Wind speeds could be gusting up to about 25 miles an hour through the day. That's yet again another factor to our forecast like we saw the past couple of days. If you are headed out, I know lots of people are excited about the Raleigh Christmas Parade tomorrow morning. Here is a look at our temperatures in the darker blue and the wind chill, what it's going to feel like, honestly the more important number, in the right kind of lighter blue. We're looking at feels like values in the 30s there at 8 o'clock, 42 at 9, getting closer to the start of the parade, and then really not much of a wind chill factor by noon when we're sitting just a degree below that 56. Our weekend on the whole looking really good. 60 tomorrow, 65 on Sunday. I do think we'll see kind of a mix of sun and clouds tomorrow. Sunday looks like more consistent sunshine. Then we turn our attention to, of course, Thanksgiving, which is getting closer and closer. We are looking at potential travel problems across some parts of the country. Keep checking back because the models have been flip-flopping on this. What I will say is there is going to be a system close to us, if not over us, into Wednesday or Thursday or Friday. It's within that time period. It looks like at this point that Wednesday would be the better travel day. The moisture would still be to our west. It may not be a great travel day if you're heading, let's say, to Nashville. But if you're heading around our general area, you're looking pretty good. Clearing out by Black Friday is the thinking at this point, but we do have scattered showers likely for the Thanksgiving time period on the day itself. So just bear that in mind. 60 for us on Saturday, 65 on Sunday. We go all the way up to close to 70 on Tuesday and then back down into Thanksgiving with some rain into most of Thanksgiving Day.